guys and welcome to weekly vlog number 13 i can't believe there's been 13 of these i have had the most productive well not productive morning so far it's been semi-productive it's currently 20 past nine i got up about half seven i did half an hour of exercise really proud of myself i did exercise last night as well like just on the exercise train i then made myself a smoothie which i still haven't like fully drank it's really nice but i just haven't drank it all yet um i don't know it's kind of like filling me up as i drink it um i got a got in the shower just done my makeup um and i've just blow dried my hair but i haven't straightened it because i'm just about to show you something exciting um the reason why i woke up so early i didn't actually set an alarm i did want to have a prediction day and get up though so i'm glad that i did wake up it was a knock on the door and i like suddenly kind of clicked and woke up ran to the front door as the postman he delivered me this lovely package which is from ghd ghd have sent me some of their straighteners which as you all know i've always had ghd I have these ones which are the red ones i've had them for about eight nine years so they are, they are on their way out but they are so worth the money they have sent me the ghd normal v gold styler which i'll show you it's in this really pretty <laughs> box and just about straight in my head i thought i'd show you how they come first so i've got this little clip thing which i think is for like the end of the straightener which is so good because currently my one's like this obviously i can put it in this packet um like this but the bl the plug has to go in this as well if that makes sense like when i travel and if they're hot i can't put them in there so what that's really good having that to go over the top they look like this they're so pretty i don't even know how you get them out literally look how pretty they are they've got all this cute pattern all over them and they're so classic and gorgeous i'm really excited to use them because obviously i've had mine for like nine years so i'm excited to have some new ones and they've also sent me some of the heat protectant spray too so they're so lovely of them i'm doing a video with them it's not sponsored but i'm just doing a video with them um next week or so or the week after um i'm not sure when it's going up i'm doing like a hairstyle video so be excited for that i'm gonna use these now and see how amazing they are because i think they're gonna be so much better than my ones because my ones were on the way out i did need some new ones so i've just finished doing my hair i've got like a little bun and then like half messy curly kind of mess type thing um i i have got quite a bit to do today i've got to film two videos one for a company again it's not sponsored it's just bits that, that i've been sent and stuff like that that i like to get out for them and then another video which is a summer clothing haul because i bought some bitch yesterday look how messy my room is over there literally just stuff everywhere um but yeah then there's a summer clothing haul which i bought some bitch yesterday for my holiday so i thought i'd pop those in a haul video um so i've got to film those also I've got my hairstyle video I'm going to film out the weekend because I need Bradley to help me with some like different camera angles so I'm going to leave that until the weekend and then I've got to revise for the rest of the day it's something really exciting is happening in a bit and um, me and Christina are going to uni to go and go in those dog rooms that sounds really weird but if you're at uni you'll probably have heard of it and it's like that exam stress puppy room where like they have loads of different they have like loads of puppies in a room and you go for like 15 minutes and you get to like cuddle them and stuff we're going at two o'clock so that should be really exciting i didn't know we were going to yesterday um so yeah really excited about that so just got a lot to fit in today basically hey guys um it's really nice like like sunshine into my window at the moment but it's making me sleepy it's now 20 to 6 um i've been to the puppy thing at um mmu which was really really cute um it was more like dogs not puppies but i'll insert a little picture here of me uh, with one of the dogs and pop a few other pictures that i took i think i only took like two pictures uh but they were really cute and you just got like a 15 minute slot with them you got to like stroke them and stuff and they were all guide dogs and it was really really cute and um, so it's a nice break from my day i've come back started revision again I had a tuna sandwich for lunch, so I thought like, I bought like some brown seeded bread from Waitrose a couple of, like, not a couple of weeks ago, a couple of days ago, um, at the week home with Bradley. So, um, I just had a tuna sandwich and that was nice for lunch. I had that about two o'clock and I'm not hungry at all, so I think I will just have a smoothie for dinner, I'm not entirely sure. I haven't really got anything in anyway. This is probably just easier for me to have a smoothie. Um, and then I can carry on revising too. I definitely want to do some exercise again tonight as well. Um, so I'm currently revising. I'm just feeling a bit sleepy. Like it's really nice and warm in my room. Um, and I feel like I look like a bit of a mess. You won't be able to tell right here because the sun is shining in a nice flattering light. But yeah, my hair is just a bit messy. It was supposed to look messy today, but just feels a bit rubbish. I think I'm going to pop my hair up um, in a ponytail or something. I might even take my makeup off in like the next hour or so. Um, but I'm just currently revising. Um, I'm quite into it to be honest like I'm not saying I'm going to carry on for the whole evening but I think I'll carry on for the next couple of hours this sun is so nice on my face <laughs> it's not even warm outside but it's just nice having the sun coming in more windows I just feel very like cosy 
crazy but like i could definitely like fall asleep right now not because i'm tired but it's just like a really nice warm like day like inside not outside you get what i'm saying guys it's um thursday morning I'm going to up really quiet because everybody else is asleep it is full on snowing look i don't know if you can see it's mental what the hell it has not snowed like that huh? the whole year that i have been in manchester and i'm like april whatever the day is should we check what the day is april the 28th it's snowing like that I'm kind of a bit worried because it's coming down heavier as it goes it's not settling well it is slightly it's not really settling but i've got to drive home and if it's worse down south then i'd prefer to leave now or not go to uni I'll see how it goes. I'll ring my dad in a bit and ask if it's bad down there. If you live in Canada or anywhere like that, you'll be like, what the hell? Literally, so heavy. Everybody else is asleep. Anyway, I'm going to put my makeup on now. It is quarter to seven, I think. Yeah, quarter to seven. Just had a shower. I'm wearing this white jumper again with black jeans. Just because I want a comfy outfit. Um, and I like this, but it looks like classy as well. Do you know what I mean? It doesn't look like, just look like I've just chucked some things on. <laughs> I just really like the jumper. Literally, it's heavy. The flakes are huge. This is ridiculous. Hey guys, I just left uni and it's 11 o'clock. I am really hungry. I had porridge this morning instead of a smoothie. It just hasn't filled me up. Like, a porridge fills me up more than a smoothie does, so I'm a bit confused, to be honest. I was going to go back and make myself a smoothie, but if I'm honest, I'm just craving chocolate or just something to, like for me to nibble on on the way home so i am going to go to the petrol station because i need to put time at petrol in this car but dad keeps telling me to run it down because obviously we're giving it back tomorrow to exchange for my new car but i'm at the point where i probably i could probably get home but i'm at like nearly at the petrol light so i'm gonna go and get some petrol just put literally like seven pounds in it or something um and then while i'm there i'm gonna get myself some nice treats just a couple of bits like i've been really good and i just want i just want some treats especially for my journey home i could stop at the surfaces and like get crispy creme couldn't i i'm just i don't know i just really just need some kind of sweetness right now so i have been notified on one comment on my weekly vlog last week and someone just tweeted me that mcdonald's strawberry lemonade are back in business how amazing is that right if you've been watching me for quite a while i'm talking back in last august you will know how obsessed i was with mcdonald's frozen strawberry lemonades they're the best thing ever apparently they're back who knew so that is a very tempting i've got a double decker here and i'm not gonna lie i've just eaten a cookie um but yeah that was it was great the cookie was great i'm gonna leave the double de double decker later on in the journey though i mean i left like 15 minutes ago and i've already devoured the cookie <laughs> Do you know what we should do? Like a little car Q&A. That'd be a good idea in the weekly vlog, wouldn't it? I don't know how I'd get the questions up. I feel like that'd be quite a good idea. Anyway, I'm just going to tell you a little fact about myself. <laughs> really randomly, I just thought, you know, you might want to know this. I much prefer, like, brownies, cookies, donuts, cake type things. Not necessarily cake, but brownies, cookies, donuts. I much prefer that to eating chocolate or sweets, like way more. I would much prefer to eat a donut than eat a chocolate bar. Is anybody else like that or is everybody like that? I don't really know. I think the majority of people prefer chocolate to like cakes. But yeah, like if I want to go and buy something or I want to be naughty, I'd much prefer to eat a Krispy Kreme. Probably 10 times as bad for you, but I just, I'd prefer it basically. And you're always on the night shift and I can So I'm home and I have been for quite a few hours. It's currently half past four. And I don't know what time I got back. What time did I get back? I think I got back about, no, 
yeah, about quarter past one, I think. Um, yeah, it took me like two hours, 15 minutes. Yeah, quarter past one. Um, yeah, I got back at quarter past one. I have been unpacking like crazy. Um, I just brought so much home because I brought stuff home like for the summer because I like, stuff I didn't need to so, like clothes, but I did beauty stuff home, some like stationery and stuff. So I've been trying to find spaces for it, reorganizing stuff. I've been chucking clothes out. I've got like a bin bag of clothes, um, to go and like if see if anybody wants them, like my family members and stuff. If not, I'm just gonna take them to the charity shop because sometimes putting stuff on depop and stuff is more effort than it's worth especially stuff that's not like gonna cost that much like nobody's gonna buy it for that much so um yeah i'm just gonna like let my cousins and my aunties and stuff have a look at it and then i'll like take it to the charity shop my eczema's really really sore on this finger can you see it? i get really bad eczema on this finger um it's really sore right now so i've just put some eczema cream hey guys on it. it's now friday i've just straightened my hair i love my new straighteners so much but i think you just realize when you use new ones like how not great your old ones were do you know what i mean so today is the day that i get my new car and i'm super duper excited i'm about to just go and empty my car at the moment like my old car what time is it it's currently half past 10 and we're going at 12 to get the car um it's quite nice weather today actually it's like blue skies there is like class in the sky but it's nice just do my makeup um i do my hair and yeah and i've got my pinafore on as usual with this little um like t-shirt from primark which is only like four pounds or so i showed it in my primark haul which was like a while ago so i'm gonna go and empty my car I'm just in a fab mood. I'm loving weekly vlogging at the moment. I'm really loving vlogging. So, um, also, I really want a daily vlog one month, like, at some point. But I just can't think when it would be. Like, I was thinking I'd do it in May. Then I've got exams. So, that's not very good, is it? Like, I can't daily vlog when I've got exams. Then, in June, June, July, and August, I'm going to be working. Um, so, I'm like, well, when do I vlog? Like, when do I daily vlog? I was waiting for September. That's ridiculous. Like, that's ages away. I just feel like I'm going to be working full-time in June, July, and August. Well, it's not going to be a very fun daily vlog, is it? So, hmm, we'll see. Let me know what you guys think. Um, but yeah, it's really rambly. So, that while cleaning out my car, look what I've just found a very dirty FIFA clamp. I think it's five. Yeah, it is five. Really dirty and sticky. It's horrible. But I thought I lost this. Look how much is left in it, like hardly anything. Because I got a new one for Christmas because I thought I'd lost it. Found it where the spare wheel was, like in the boot. It was literally on the spare wheel, like underneath the thing that you pull up in a boot. What the hell? I'm gonna like give it a good old wipe because it's got all fur on it and it's all sticky and horrible. Poor little matte lipstick. Um, there was nothing else exciting in there though, so. Yeah, I'm so excited. It's now like 20 past 11. Just cleaned up the car, sorted all services throughout our um, freezer in the garage. The plug came and done last night. Don't really know how. Something fell off and that like, hit the plug or whatever. So the whole freezer melted. So I've just been helping Dad clear the freezer out um, and put everything in bags and stuff to take the tip. Um, I should clean this up. Then have a little, I don't know, mooch, chat with Dad. Then it'll be time to go. I'm so excited. I'm really, 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 really excited. I don't know what this is going to be called though. I don't really name my cars. Like, I've only had one. But like, I know like some of my friends at school were really like, what's his name? What's his name? Whereas... I, I called mine Rupert, but I never said, oh, I'm going to get into Rupert. I wonder what this one's going to be called. A bit more of a grown-up name, because it's more of a grown-up car. I'm so excited. Literally about to run out the door to try and get the car. But look what I just did really quickly. I found these little copper fairy lights on, like, a wire that I've got. I showed them in an eBay haul before. If I can find them in the them down below. And I just sanitate them on the thing. Look how cute they look. I put them all down here. It makes it look really pretty. Please ignore, like, the mess. But, yeah, it makes it look super pretty. Just thought I'd show you my crazy DIY before I run out the door. But, yeah. Look. Guys, I've got my car. Literally, it's the cutest thing in the whole world. I love it so much. It drives, like, so different to my old car. Like, literally, it's so, so nice. So, yeah, I've had it for, like, a couple of hours now. Me and Bradley are going to go to Milton Keynes. Um, just for him to get, he wants some shirts and some ties. He starts his new job next week. As I've said 500 times in this vlog. Um, I'm going to go out for dinner. Just because it's now, like... What time is it? Like 20 past two? What time is it? Yeah, half past, well 25 minutes past two. Um, so yeah, we're probably gonna go for dinner as well. He's just in the shower at the moment, she's getting ready and then we'll probably leave in like 45 minutes or so. Uh, it takes like 45 minutes to get there. Well then, probably gonna have dinner, all that kind of stuff. So yeah, I'm really excited. I've just changed over my insurance as well. Um, and that only cost 60 pounds, which I thought was quite good. Like they could have been like, that will cost you 400 pounds. Um, 
but yeah literally so excited um so yeah literally the best feeling ever i've only driven it like back from like the, the car place which i'm talking is like 10 minutes around the corner from our house um and then i drove to my mum's for with my brother just to go out in the car <laughs> which is literally five minutes so i'm really excited to go along driving it it's like the best thing ever i was so excited and also i had to fill up the, um like petrol because they only filled up like a quarter of a tank like from the car place and anyway, i filled it with petrol and it's completely different to my other car it's on the other side of the car to start with dad was there doing it with me well i couldn't get the thing in like there was it was completely different there was no cap on the like petrol thing as you open the petrol thing if you have a car you'll know what i'm talking about like once you open the petrol thing there was no cap inside which was very confusing um but yeah i had like the best day ever i was surprised i haven't done any revision so that's not very good but i've got a new car who wants to see revision when you've got a new car hey guys so we've come to milton keynes and my drive was good um brother's with me um and he's absolutely starving so i'm gonna just pop into m &S. i'm not hungry in the slightest yet um we're definitely gonna go out for dinner but i'm just gonna pop into m &S to get brother a snack like i don't know a cookie or something um and then we're just gonna pop to primark I might not have a cookie, I'm Well, anyway, I'm going to go to Primark, then we're going to go to the actual centre MK and go actual shopping after. So, yeah, got a dumb dumb. This is in H&M and he's driving me oh insane. <laughs> All he's looking at is white t-shirts. White t-shirts? So hard to find a white t-shirt. It's so hard to find a white t-shirt that it's really nice. I want white t-shirts. Oh, I'm sure Bradley would like this. No, because you... Oh! It's long sleeve. Oh, there you go. Christ. Yeah, but look. Can you see my hand? This dictates Not that you can nearly. see my large, bad coloured nipples. <laughs> Everyone's going to know this now. <laughs> We're just in H&M. Just thought I'd show you because I'm really, really bored. I'm really upset right now. Do you call this a Pizza Hut cookie dough? No, you don't. Look how small it is. It's not focused on it. You get more ice cream than you do cookies. And you get proper silver spoons. Proper silver spoons, only because I didn't have any takeaway ones. Literally, look at the size of that. How bad is that? Hi guys, <laughs> I just wanted to show you that I've got the strawberry lemonade. So Bradley's just vlogging for me. But I thought I'd just show you. I've got a McDonald's strawberry frozen strawberry lemonade. First one of the year. And it's absolutely fab. This car is going to be shocking because you keep going in bumps and I'm doing this. Oh, it's fine, don't worry. <laughs> um, but yeah, just thought I'd let you know. Sorry for the random piece of vlog footage. <laughs> Hi guys, um, it's now nine o'clock and I'm just in my car. I love it so much. Like literally, I have been the happiest girl in the world today. I have been so happy, I've been in such a good mood all day, all down to my car. Um, and honestly, I'm just so thankful and grateful to have a new car. I just, oh, I love it so much. I can't even explain, like it drives so nice. And oh, I just love it so much for a kid. I literally like a kid. The healthy eating is going absolutely fabulous. This is what I look like right now. <laughs> oh my god, it is so rainy. Literally, we just went to Pets at Home to get some of Bradley's rabbit. Literally, it's not Bradley's rabbit, it's Bradley's family's rabbit. Anyway, went to Pets at Home. It was nice, it was sunny. The cloud was like really great, but it was nice. It was quite, quite, quite hot. Got in the car, drove back. Torrential rain. Then it's like snowing. Then it's like hailing. It is ridiculous. It is now. 20 to 2 um and i am about to go for a coffee with mum i've just left bradley at his um my hair looks horrible i'm just gonna brush it through because it feels like all like you know when it's rained on it feels all horrible me and mum are gonna go for a coffee and go for lunch i'm really hungry Good morning guys it's now sunday i've literally just got out of bed um it is like 10 to 9 i've been like in and out of sleep since about half seven um but i've been mostly awake and i've just got out of bed i had a really nice day yesterday um but today i'm gonna have a really nice day but i'm just like in quite of a productive mood more youtube wise this morning i haven't revised at all as i've been at home but i've kind of expected that that was gonna happen but all i know is that for the next week i have literally got nothing on I have no excuses not to revise for the next whole week, so I will be fine. I feel quite comfortable with my second exam now as well, which is on the 18th. I really, really want to film two videos today. Um, the first video is a spring hairstyle video. Um, it's like not for GHD, but when GHD sent me those straighteners at the start of this vlog, um, I'm going to do a, bring, a spring hairstyle video with them, but it's not sponsored or anything. They just kind of like sent me the straighteners to kind of like do the video with. Um, so I'm going to film that, but I really want to make it really good. So I'm going to get ask Bradley if he can come round and help me to film that one. 
Hey guys, so it's now quarter past 12 um, and I have filmed two first impressions videos, like the start of them and I'll obviously carry on doing them throughout the day. Then I went to Waitrose with Dad and then I've also gone and got a new memory card. I've just gone and picked up a new memory card because I don't know if you remember but like about a month ago or a bit a bit more than that, it was when I was in Bournemouth actually, when I went on my holiday, um, one of my memory cards broke, the one that was in my normal Canon 700D. Do I have the 700D? Yes, yeah, 700D. In there, that one broke in my main channel camera. So I've been using the same SD card for like my vlog camera and my main channel videos and just swapping them over. But for one of my videos today, I want to use both cameras at once. So I've got, I've got another one. So I went to Argos, got that. Went to Waitrose, had a little mooch. It's now quarter past 12. I'm slightly peckish actually. Um, I'm about to pop around to mum's because I've got like a huge bag of clothes and a few beauty bits that I don't want anymore that I kind of like sorted out when I came home on Thursday. Um, so I've got all those in a bag. So I'm going to take those around to her to have a little look at, see if she wants any of the things and just have a little chat with her for the next couple of hours. So it's now Monday and I'm still at home. It's 12 o'clock and I've decided to stay for today maybe stay for tomorrow and maybe go back wednesday basically i was gonna go back this morning like i normally do on a monday but obviously i don't have uni anymore it's literally just exam revision like uni's not on for anyone anymore like this is the start of exam season now because it's like may um so going back there was no necessarily necessarily reason that i would like have to go back for it just to arise so i was thinking i'll get more done in manchester i'll go back but when i thought about it i hadn't had my video edited for tonight and i was gonna have to leave at like say i left at like 11 which is when i would have been ready I leave at 11, get back for like half one, two o'clock. Then by the time I get back, I need to go food shopping. Like that would take me, uh, not an hour, but to leave to go food shopping, go food shopping, come back, put it back. That would have taken me an hour. So that takes me to three o'clock. Then I would have had to unpack. That takes me half an hour. That's half three. Then I would have had to edit the video, which would have had to be done beforehand anyway. But that would have taken me to like half four. Then it's half four and I haven't done any revision all day. So my thought was, what I'm going to do is just do revision here and I might stay here. Well, I'm definitely staying here today um, and tonight. And then I may stay here tomorrow and tomorrow night and I may go back on Wednesday. I've got quite a lot done this morning, actually. I've done this mind map um this morning on like csr which is one of the topics um and i've got quite a lot of information on there it's making me understand it a lot more i'm just doing like a for and against page now like a little mind map thing then i'm going to do some business examples on mind map and then we'll do it for another topic and then i'm going to sit and revise it for the rest of the day and write some mock answers um so i am kind of feeling like i'm getting a better gra 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 grasp 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 of things um also bradley's at home too so it just kind of makes sense um to be honest so yeah that's the situation bradley stayed around last night but he's gone back to his because he's doing his his assignment and um well we just thought it'd be better to just do it separately so yeah that's what's happening i'm gonna see him later we're gonna have dinner together and get some subway cookies together um this evening as a little treat for doing our work it's not very nice weather today it's very like dark outside um i need to put some lights on it's currently 20 past one how it's got to that time i don't really know it still feels like 10 in the morning of am honest i'm gonna take this clip out of my hair hair hurts um anyway what i was gonna say was um bradley is about to come around we're gonna go to subway and get some lunch um because we have one of those sandwiches do you and any of you guys remember it was a couple of weekly vlogs ago and um we had a subway like beef sandwich and i had never had a subway before in my life like i just i'm not really a sandwich person and we had the cookies and it was so good so we're gonna go and get them get some cookies and yeah like i haven't been very good at healthy eating to be honest but i'm now in revision mode like i can't i can healthy eat but you just want chocolate in revision mode don't you so we're gonna go and get that bradley's gonna come here we're gonna go to boys together get some sandwiches and some cookies and then we're gonna come back and we're gonna try and do it do it together like obviously we're not revising the same thing we're on completely different degrees we're not completely different same degree different university i sit in my lounge downstairs I'm going to do my revision and Brad is going to do his assignment and we're just going to try and like concentrate because I've just realised that I haven't watched Vampire Diaries from last Friday and like if I'm by myself for the rest of the day I am going to stop at some point and watch that like I just know exactly what I'm like like I'm, I'm committed to the cause of revising but well I want to watch Vampire Diaries whereas if Bradley's here I'm not going to go I'm going to go and watch Vampire Diaries I'm like I'm going to get on with my revision so yeah and he like needs to do these assignments like you know like for revision you don't well you do need to do it but like if you didn't do it and you went to the exam you might pass if you don't do it if you just do this assignment and you don't hand it in you're not going to pass do you understand what i'm saying well that's kind of my theory so we're going to try and like motivate each other so we're going to go to the boys cover 
get the sandwiches and stuff. I've just finished doing like three different mind maps. This is my first one. Then I did like a for and against of the topic, which doesn't look very cool. Oh, I've just realised I haven't highlighted one side of that. And then I've just done like a business examples mind map. So I've just done all of those for one of my like topics. I just had a heart attack because the camera wouldn't turn on. Oh my God. Please ignore the fact I've got no lipstick on. I always like eat my breakfast and stuff first then put my lipstick on. So I always look really weird because I've got like... I don't know, foundation on my lips. Um, I'm just having some porridge with some ras no, not raspberries, strawberries and blueberries. The normal one I normally have, the waitress cacao one, it's the best one. Um, with some clementine juice, which is really nice as well. Um, I'm just about to dry my hair. It's actually quite late, it's 20 to 11. I have no idea how it got to that time. I woke up at half eight and I swear I've like done everything quite quickly. The day is just disappearing from me. So I'm gonna dry my hair. I do need to film this hairstyle video for GHD. Um, and I haven't like I was going to film it on Sunday and I never did. Um, it just kind of went a bit wrong. I don't know whether to film it this morning once I've dried my hair or whether to just start a revision. I'm in two minds about it. Um, but I'm going to get into revision as soon as I've dried my hair and stuff. I just can't believe the time. I don't understand how it got to that time in the slightest. Um, but I'm going to eat my breakfast, dry my hair and stuff, and then get stuck into some revision. Um, I'm just going to like, I've written out loads of stuff that I did yesterday. So I'm just going to like sit and try and revise the stuff that I wrote out and maybe write some answers or something. Today, is like my memorising day, I really want to get stuck into like memorising this stuff. Um, so yeah, I'm just watching um, Joe Suggs vlog um, from a couple of days ago and eating this and yeah, that's my situation. I'm now at Bradley's house revising because I couldn't concentrate by myself. Why is it not canned? Give... <laughs> Not allowed on the sofa, sweetheart. I couldn't revise by myself, so I kept sitting there and going on Facebook. Um, so I brought a revision stuff around here. He's just finishing an assignment, um, and I'm just sat here revising. I did have the whole thing to be really healthy. I made a smoothie for lunch, everything, brought it around here, was drinking it, and then I was like, hmm, should we have some chocolate? And it was in my car. So we've got some dairy milk mixed buttons. Uh, which I've wanted to try for ages because they're just like obviously buttons but like together and then we've got some dimes because these are our favourite chocolates um, so that's what we're powering through we're going to do another hour of like revision and like he's going to do another hour of like assignments and then we're going to take um, candy for a walk which is Bradley's dog and yeah just have a bit of a wander it was really nice weather earlier now the sky's gone a bit grey this is really nice at the weekend though, so that's good. Um, but yeah, I'm going to go back to Manchester tomorrow. I also realised I need to edit this entire weekly vlog tonight, which is um, quite a task, because especially when I'm going back tomorrow morning, I've got quite a lot to do on this. Um, so that is not the greatest. Um, my video last night hasn't got that many views at the moment, so I don't really quite know why. Um, but it's a first impressions video, so if you haven't seen it already, go and give that a little watch. Um... Yeah, I just thought I'd update you, say hey. Um, I really need to edit some of the weekly vlog. Maybe I'll do like another half an hour of this revision and then do half an hour of editing the weekly vlog because it needs to be done. So it's now about quarter to ten, I think. I'm going to go to sleep now, so I'm going to end the weekly vlog. Um, I know I haven't vlogged too much today. Um, I know I was just revising. Sorry if it's echoey, by the way. I'm in the bathroom because it's much better lighting in here. Um, but yeah, I don't know. Like we just were revising, like at Bradley's. Um, I did get stuck into it. Then I was editing the weekly vlog, so I didn't have as much to do this evening, which I'm really grateful that I did that earlier. <laughs> um, and then I went to mum's for dinner because I haven't been to hers the whole weekend just because like she always has like things on at the weekend so I normally like stay at dad's and it's just a bit easier um but like when I'm back like for summer and stuff I normally spend like half the week at mum's and half the week at dad's and that's perfectly fine but over the weekend it's really difficult to do that because it's like back and forth over a couple of days it's really nice to see her this evening have dinner around hers and stuff but again all my stuff is here and because I'm going back tomorrow there was absolutely no point in me like taking all my stuff there for just for one night um so i've come back here um to sleep i've been at hers all evening we had dinner and stuff together it was really really nice we watched a program about Claridge's as well which is like a really posh like high-end london hotel which i didn't know about and it was like so like interesting it was so good now i just desperately want to go there for like afternoon tea it's like 58 pounds each for afternoon tea we were looking online like what the hell anyway rambling there um i've just taken my makeup off and just put my hair up i don't know if you guys have been noticing but i've been putting my hair up in ponytails not like my hair looks great there but i've been putting my hair up in ponytails and me going to sleep now 
rather than in a bun because I find that it's less knotty if I put it in a ponytail. When I put it in a bun sometimes, like it goes really knotty in the morning, whereas in a ponytail it doesn't go as knotty. So I've been leaving it in a ponytail, it seems to be working for me. Anyway, another tangent. <laughs> I'm going to end this weekly vlog here. I know it hasn't been slightly as long as the others, but I was editing it and Friday's, Friday's part of the vlog literally made me so happy. I loved it so much. So I hope you guys have enjoyed this vlog um, and enjoyed this week. I hope you have had a lovely week yourself please give this video a big thumbs up if you have enjoyed it leave me a comment down below and please subscribe to my channel if you haven't before um so you'll be notified of all my new videos and i will speak to you next time bye